Today I'm going to demonstrate transverse and longitudinal waves and explain the key difference between them. Now, first of all, this is a wave machine. It is used to demonstrate waves in a classroom. You have probably seen one of them. Now, when I rotate the wheel, I create a wave. This is a transverse wave. You can see the peaks of the wave traveling to the right. But if you look at each individual particle, for example this one, it's merely vibrating up and down, up and down, up and down. This is the key thing about waves. The wave is traveling to the right, but the particles are just vibrating up and down. The particles are not moving to the right. Now, this is a longitudinal wave. Now, you can see the particles vibrating up and down, but the wave is traveling upwards. Look at it. see the waves actually moving, but the particles stay where they are, they just move up and down slightly. The same idea, when I speak to you, I create sound waves, and the sound waves travel into the microphone, or if you're in a classroom, into your ears. It doesn't mean the air from my mouth is traveling into your ears. It's just the waves. The air stays where it is. It's just the waves, just the energy. Let's recap the definition of a wave. Waves carry energy and information without a net motion of the medium through which they travel. This is it. The wave travels, but the particles stay where they are. Thank you. Goodbye.